tenth start behind the plate. The first pitch and he pops it up in foul territory. Spencer Horst Ryu and you can see that big slow curb. Jammed him and a wheel to second. Davis Schneider on to Spencer. Big slow breaking curveball. This is an easy pitch for a hitter to give up on because it's so far away from you when it's yes, over a thousand. Brandon Belt going on the IL today. Batter. In fair territory, Nathaniel. Jonathan Ornelius is at third base. Corey Seager and Simeon up the middle. Nathaniel Lowe. Cruiser hasn't seen a lot of them. All to right field, but it's going to wind up in the glove of Grossman. Two down. Right, right center in center field. Then he stays on this breaking ball and hits it hard, but right at the right field. Right center field. Leody Tavares is there. And the Rangers a big favor. Jonah Heim down to third, diving stop, Biggio, and another. And the team. He goes a long way to his left and then pops to his feet. One thing I've noticed since he's been. Nathan Lucas is here with the Blue Jays and active. And a fly ball to left field, easy play for Dolphins. These good giant teams. In the air to center, but it's playable for Kevin Kiermeyer. And as he's Spencer Horwitz. Who was playing first tonight, hitting in the cleanup spot. Delivery has allowed him to be consistent. But up the alley in left center is going to get to the wall. They're good at bat for Kevin. Side of the infield, Horwitz, the first baseman, is there. And ground ball left side, charging Bichette. Throws on the run and gets him. And a changeup hit. To shallow right, but Simeon this retreats and makes a nice catch. To the bat, and that's going to drop for a base hit. Murray. The middle, Simeon to step on the bag and throw to first. And I think tomorrow. Seeger bounces one up the middle for a base hit. First hit of the night. Back out there on the field. Dan. Turns on the first pitch from Hyun Jin. Spot tonight against Ryu, and this ball is supposed to be a cutter, and he was all over. Jeff grounded to short, right at Bichette, and Mitch Garber is retired. He's got a base hit, swinging at the first pitch again. It's pitch counts, and he's just trying to get ahead right here, and I'm hit a 20. Guard just a few minutes. Her ball grounded out to short. Bichette's got it. Good play. Short, Seeger has it. One down. And he said his first at bat, he didn't swing at one pitch, and he struck out looking. His very now two down here, Schneider. And a fair side the line. His way to second, and he. The umpire is literally right on top of the. Duran is there. And Biggio and the Blue Jays. Jonathan Ornelis. Pops a change up up. And there, and fortunately they didn't collide. And no one stepped on pitches of the at bat. But a shallow right, in comes Springer. And he's there. Three up. Fair ball down to first. A nice play by Lowe. The effort is consistent. He knows it's hit to the first baseman. He hustles over there. Look how early he is there. Curve ball. This one popped up into center field. Tavares is there for the bottom of the fifth. This one to shallow center, and that's caught by Tavares. And that's a three up combination. Into right center field. Kiermeyer backs him up, but Seeger's got him. You want Springer. He's got a long run. Kiermeyer is pointing to him because Kevin was. Towards right field, and Springer's got to play it on a bounce to make sure it was going to drop, so he'll come. The ball hit the turfs halfway between second and third, and then the ball hits the ground, and he can advance, but only. Right field, Springer the catch, coming home, and in ahead of. Much momentum into the throw, but you see this pitch, I mean, that's a. Curveball sounded like he might have broken his bat. Then took a cold third strike on a very slow curveball, and that curveball once again. <laughs> and a swing and a miss. He puts away low again. But the Rangers do add a. Late in April. Springer bounces it foul, still 0 and 2. And a high curve.
Cutter fouled back. Still 0 and 2 on Springer. Fastball in. He still has enough zip. Change up, and that's a tough pitch to take if you're George Springer. But it would. This one gets through. Scherzer Bean is there to throw out Springer. Version of Max Scherzer and. A very good version of Max Scherzer is a very good pitcher. Going to fly ball to right, but it is playable for Robbie Grossman. Two down. Experience duo of manager and pitching coach then Bruce Bochy and Mike Maddox. Yeah, the right hander here in this situation. Guerrero has and he gets Guerrero strikes him out on three pitches. Hit his first major league home run last night. He went two for four in that game last night and gun. It's going to be down and off the wall on a bounce. And Leody Tavares into. Big hack and it's 0 and 1. And Smith played last night. He played play. is going to come in to score Smith on his way to second and in there and this is a breaking ball that spins on Simeon it was 0 for 3 well Texas have come out playing well back to the mound Garcia looks the runner back and throws out Simeon two down and he takes a fastball for a strike Base hit. Smigger is on his way to second. The third double of the out over the plate, and Seager hits it down the right field corner. Oh, he is smoking hot right now. Three hit game of the season. Second in the American League behind only Yandy Diaz. Spencer Horowitz leads it off. Jose Leclerc still in the game. Off the wall. And lead off double. Toward the playing field, and Horowitz is able to get to second base. Who had a double his last time up, one for two on the night. So the Blue Jays have four hits, and Horowitz and Sh well, but it'll be caught on the track. And Kowski, Horowitz will come to outside three and one. All right, we just showed you about Snyder in and Beasley. Base hit into right field for Biggio. Oh. Left center. And that's down for Biggio on his way to third. Time you can't take a risk to get thrown out in a game like this Toronto when you're trying to come the back. Call at second base. Inside a ball and a strike. Out off one and two. Breaking ball. We mentioned Bear Gilt. Bounces one to first. He will be retired, but a run will. 12 pitches. And he starts Alejandro Kirk with a strike. Kirk pitch hitting for Tyler. Heim. Blocked by Heim. And remember, there's a runner at third. That's Espinal. And he takes a strike. One and two. Up left side and Whit bouncer to short. Seeger's got it, and the inning is open. And the ball will find you, as the saying goes. And that's what Jonah Heim, one for two with a sack fly, still trailing five to This one is bounced up the middle, waiting his bow on to Horwitz, two down, and a ground ball to second. Nice inning. And up the middle, but stationed right is Marcus Simeon for the first down. He was planning to pull as much as you can these days with the restrictions on the bag to make a play on Spurn. Shet with a one hopper to short circles around it and makes the play two down. 
And he reached for that one and he pops it into left. Carter is in and the inning. 0 oh 2. Aroldis Chapman is up in the bullpen for the Rangers, and there goes Carter. The pitch swung on and missed. The throw down on a bounce, and not in time. And you'd like to retire them in order so you don't have to face the top of this lineup. Jimmy and Seager, they have been. Biggio has room. Coming to third is Carter. Ball to left, and that's down for a base. One run in to score. It is. Espinal in foul territory will okay with that. This is not going to make it any worse as he takes a pitch up into the backstop. Ball one and and he does that one and one. That's 96. He's averaging 100 on his.